Before we get into this video guys, I'm giving away free Catwoman pickaxes to my subscribers, so therefore make sure to comment down below why you want to win it. I'm about to show you the best Fortnite settings for low-end PCs here in Season 4 guys, and trust me, this will help to improve your performance on any PC you're trying to play it. I'm going to show you everything which is necessary in order to achieve at least 100 FPS on basically any device guys, and if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like. What I want you to do now in the first place guys, is go here and next up to your Fortnite settings, and you can already see that I'm playing on some very specific settings. We have 1280 times 720 guys, which you should utilize 100%. If you're trying to use any of the stretch resolutions, which I already recommended on my channel, I just uploaded a couple of days ago a brand new video about the top five best stretch resolutions for low-end PCs, which I'm going to put right now on this info icon or also in the end card after the video. So therefore make sure that you watch it. Then next up for your frame rate limit, guys, you can see right now mine is kept at 360, but I want to give you a special tip, guys. Let's just say as an example that you're running 60 hertz, which probably most low-end PC players are playing on. Cap your FPS on something like 100. 20 to 144 fps still get a little bit more than 60 fps so you can reduce your input delay but let's just say as an example that you would have it on something like maybe even like 200 fps and in some instances you can actually hit that your pc is just going to work way too hard to get those 200 fps which is going to overheat it and therefore maybe even cause thermal threatening which means that if your pc gets too warm it's just going to overall decrease the performance because sometimes there are just simply these moments where you can't even hit like on the worst pc 200 fps because you're looking into the sky or some stuff like that so so therefore prevent that. Then next up guys for your 3D resolution I figured out 70% is the best or better set like the minimum you kind of need in order to still have like a playable gaming experience so therefore keep it on 70 to 75 percentage. Viewing distance on near, textures on low, everything else on off or the lowest possible and of course the performance mode guys. Don't try out DirectX 11 or DirectX 12 even not with the new performance mode on DirectX 11 it's still going to run worse so therefore just simply performance mode on the beta. Once we go over to audio please make sure that your sound quality what is actually on low guys and that you turn off visualized sound effects. I know this is a super useful feature but of course it's also really hard with the menu. And there you go guys these are the bare minimum settings for Fortnite which you need to still have a playable gaming experience and please don't forget to comment down below which GPU you guys are actually running right now because I'm highly interested in that and with that said we're basically done here.